Imagine someone who remains calm no matter what life throws at them, radiating an inner strength and unwavering calmness that stands tall against any external chaos. This person embodies the teachings of ancient Stoic philosophers who believe that true power comes from within. A truly powerful person doesn't get swayed by others' opinions or the minor disruptions around them. This resilience and steadfast purpose can often be perceived as intimidating by others. Today, we're going to explore nine signs that form an intimidating personality. Remember, being intimidating might seem negative, but if these signs are used correctly, they showcase strength and create a strong power of attraction towards others. Before we dive in, please subscribe to the channel and leave a like. It helps us a lot and costs you nothing. Let's get started. Number one, other people's validation is not important to you. One of the standout traits of an intimidating personality is emotional independence from external validation. Picture this. You're like a rock, unshaken by the waves of others' opinions. People who don't rely on others' approval to feel good about themselves exude a kind of self-confidence that can be overwhelming to those around them. This emotional autonomy is seen in behaviors like confidently making decisions, following your own interests and beliefs, and not being influenced by what others think. When you don't seek validation from outside, your actions and words reflect an inner certainty this security can make others feel insecure or intimidated, especially those who depend more on social approval for their self-esteem. Your ability to move forward without needing positive reinforcement from others demonstrates an inner strength that many may find difficult to confront or understand. This resilience, much like the Stoics' approach to life's ups and downs, makes you appear unshakable and resistant to criticism. While others may hesitate or doubt themselves in the face of disapproval, your emotional independence allows you to stay firm on your path. This silent resilience and determination can be extremely intimidating, as it shows that you are self-sufficient and not easily swayed by others' opinions. Number two, you have extensive knowledge. An intimidating personality often comes with extensive knowledge on various subjects, Imagine being in a room where you can discuss almost anything with depth and clarity. When you demonstrate a deep and detailed understanding in multiple areas, it can easily make others feel inferior or insecure. This vast knowledge base not only impresses but also acts as a form of power. Knowledge, as they say, is power, and those who possess it can argue convincingly, provide precise information, and solve complex problems with ease. This ability can intimidate those who feel less informed or prepared. In meetings, debates, or casual discussions, your fluency in citing facts, theories, and examples can silence others, making them reluctant to contest your opinions or viewpoints. Moreover, this characteristic can create a dynamic where others feel constantly evaluated or judged, knowing that you possess superior knowledge this can make them hesitate to express their ideas or questions, fearing they might appear less intelligent or informed. This environment can be intimidating, making others feel uncomfortable or apprehensive in your presence. In summary, having extensive knowledge is a clear sign of a personality that can intimidate others. Your mastery of a wide range of subjects not only impresses, but also sets a high standard that many may find difficult to match, reinforcing your position of influence and respect. Number three, you prefer to be rational rather than follow the crowd. Another clear sign of an intimidating personality is the preference for making rational decisions rather than simply following the crowd. Think about it. While others are swept away by the tide of popular opinion, you stand firm, guided by logic and reason. 
people who value logic and reason over social conformity tend to stand out. Their objective and independent approach can challenge conventional thinking. This characteristic is particularly intimidating to those who feel more comfortable following social norms and prevailing opinions. Opting to be rational means you analyze situations based on facts, evidence and sound arguments rather than being swayed by emotions or group pressure. This approach can make you appear more assertive and confident in your decisions, which can be intimidating to those accustomed to seeking consensus and approval from others. Your ability to stay firm in your convictions, even when they go against the grain, demonstrates inner strength and independent thinking that many may find unsettling. Additionally, your tendency to question and challenge the status quo can create discomfort in environments where conformity is the norm. When you present rational arguments that contradict popular opinions, it can expose the lack of foundation or superficial thinking of those who simply follow the crowd. This can lead others to feel insecure or more defensive as they are forced to reassess their own beliefs and decisions. Number four, you are decisive and direct. People who make decisions quickly and clearly without hesitation often make others feel insecure or pressured. This assertiveness demonstrates a confidence that can be overwhelming for those who tend to be more indecisive or who prefer to avoid confrontations. Being decisive means evaluating situations quickly and acting with determination even in moments of uncertainty. This ability to make firm decisions conveys a sense of control and competence, which can be intimidating for those who do not share the same level of self-confidence. Others may feel that their own decision-making abilities are insufficient or question whether their opinions carry the same weight. In addition to decision-making, being direct in your communication amplifies this perception. Direct people speak their minds clearly and without beating around the bush, avoiding ambiguities. Although this honesty is valued, it can be unsettling for those accustomed to more gentle and indirect communication. Frankness can be seen as confrontational, especially if others are not prepared to deal with the truth in such a blunt and immediate manner. This combination of quick decision-making and direct communication can create an environment where others feel compelled to act or respond with the same speed and clarity, which is not always comfortable for everyone. Your assertive and determined presence demands an equally strong response, making others feel challenged to raise their own level of assertiveness and clarity. Number five, you have strong moral codes. People with a firm sense of ethics and principles tend to remain unwavering in their convictions, regardless of external pressures. This commitment to personal values can be intimidating to those who are more flexible or influenced by circumstances. When you have strong moral codes, your decisions and actions are guided by a clear set of principles. This clarity can be seen as an unshakable force, making others feel insecure or question their own beliefs. The consistency with which you apply your values can highlight the lack of firmness in the moral codes of others, creating an uncomfortable contrast. Moreover, people with strong moral codes often do not hesitate to speak out against injustices or behaviors they consider wrong, even if it means facing opposition. This moral courage can be seen as intimidating, especially in situations where conformity or complacency is the norm. Your willingness to stand up for what you believe in can make others feel pressured to reassess their own actions and choices. Commitment to high ethical standards also means that you expect the same level of integrity from others. This expectation can create an environment of high responsibility where those around you feel the need to elevate their own standards. For those who do not share the same level of moral commitment, this pressure can be uncomfortable and intimidating. Number six, your words carry weight. 
When your words carry weight, every comment or opinion you express holds implicit authority. People may hesitate to contest or disagree with you, not only out of respect, but also out of fear of being wrong. This effect can be especially pronounced in professional or social environments where your expertise and experience are recognized and valued. Your ability to communicate clearly, assertively, and persuasively contributes to this perception. By articulating your thoughts convincingly, you can influence the course of discussions and decisions, often without needing to raise your voice or be insistent. This ability to shape conversations and direct thoughts with your words can make others feel pressured or intimidated, especially if they do not possess the same confidence or communication skills. The perception that your words carry weight also creates a constant expectation that your opinions will always be wise and well-founded. This can place others in a position of admiration, but also discomfort, feeling that they need to match your level of insight and clarity. The pressure to live up to the expectations generated by your words can be intimidating for many. Number seven, you are comfortable being alone. The ability to enjoy your own company and find satisfaction in solitary activities indicates an inner strength and confidence that many may find difficult to understand. Your emotional independence suggests that you do not need anyone to feel complete or fulfilled, which can make others feel insecure about their own social dependence. Moreover, this characteristic can be seen as a sign that you are selective in your social interactions. Instead of seeking approval or constant company from others, you carefully choose whom you spend your time with. This can make others feel pressured to prove their worth to gain your attention, which can be quite intimidating. Your comfort in being alone also means that you do not fear solitude or introspection. This security in your own skin allows you to get to know yourself better, develop your own interests, and grow personally without the constant influence of others. This level of self-knowledge and self-acceptance can be overwhelming for those who have not yet reached this stage of emotional independence. Number eight, you can have difficult conversations. A clear sign of a personality that intimidates others is the ability to face and conduct difficult conversations with confidence and clarity. People who do not shy away from complicated or delicate discussions demonstrate a courage and assertiveness that can be overwhelming for those around them. This ability to address sensitive or controversial topics without hesitation reflects inner strength and communication skills that many may find intimidating. Having difficult conversations requires not only courage, but also a high level of empathy and communication skills. You can express your opinions and feelings directly and honestly, without being swayed by the emotion of the moment. This can make others feel uncomfortable or pressured, especially if they do not have. The same ability to articulate their thoughts and emotions in intense situations. Number nine, you stand out in group settings. Whether in work meetings, social events, or team activities, your presence is felt and hard to ignore. This ability to capture attention and naturally impose yourself can be intimidating to those who prefer to remain unnoticed or who do not have the same ease in standing out. When you stand out in groups, it is usually because you possess characteristics such as charisma, eloquence, and confidence. Your ability to articulate ideas clearly and persuasively makes others gravitate toward you, valuing your opinions and leadership. This natural dominance can make other people feel less secure about their own contributions, especially if they perceive that their ideas do not have the same impact or recognition. Moreover, you may stand out for your ability to dynamically manage group interactions. You can mediate discussions, resolve conflicts, and guide the direction of conversations effectively. This ability to influence the course of interactions can be seen as a sign of power, making others aware that you have a strong and influential presence. 
For many, this can be intimidating as matching or challenging this influence requires a level of self-confidence and skill that not everyone possesses. Your dominant presence in groups also suggests that you have a strong sense of identity and purpose. People who know what they want and have clarity about their goals tend to inspire respect and sometimes intimidation. Others may feel pressured to match this level of clarity and determination, which can be a daunting task. I hope you enjoyed the video since you made it to the end. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe. See you soon.